Throughout the year, terms like equinox and solstice get banded around by people without much thought. Yet others go so far as to celebrate the summer solstice or wish you a happy solstice in much the same way as they would wish you a happy new year. But what actually is a solstice or an equinox and how are they different to each other? Let's start with the equinox. The equinoxes occur in March and September and are the times when the sun is exactly above the equator. In the northern hemisphere, this signals the start of spring in March and the beginning of fall in the southern hemisphere. The March equinox is often called the vernal equinox or the spring equinox. The term equinox comes from the Latin word aequus, meaning equal, and nox, meaning night, creating the term equal night. Because of the angle of Earth on its axis, which is roughly 23.5 degrees, our orientation towards the sun changes throughout the year. There comes a point when the lengths of each day are roughly equal to the lengths of each night, because the sun is on the celestial equator. This gives roughly 12 hours of both daylight and night, depending on your distance from the equator. Now we move on to the solstices. The solstices also occur twice a year, the winter solstice and the summer solstice. The latter occurs around June 21st in the northern hemisphere, while the winter solstice happens around December 21st. At the summer solstice, the sun reaches the highest point of the year, while at the winter solstice, it reaches the lowest all year. This is the time in the year when the sun's path is furthest north or south from the equator, when the planet's poles are extremely inclined towards the sun or away from it. The northern hemisphere is tilted towards the sun, giving increased hours of sunlight. In some places such as Scandinavia, they can have a full 24 hours of sunlight. This means the winter solstice has the shortest day of the year, and the summer solstice is the longest day of the year. Solstices can be defined by solar declination, which is the latitude of Earth where the sun is directly overhead at noon. The solar declination refers to the angle between the sun's rays and the equatorial plane. At the summer solstice, the solar declination is about 23.5 degrees north at the Tropic of Cancer. And in December, the solar declination is about 23.5 degrees south at the Tropic of Capricorn. These events can be predicted down to the minute. So in 2024, the March equinox occurs at 11.06 p.m. EDT on March 19th, or 03.06 GMT on March 20th. Thank you for watching Eiffel Science. Don't forget to subscribe for more science videos.